So, you finally come. You're Ishimura, the foreign minister. I am he. I've wanted to meet you. You're Hyuga's son, aren't you? Yeah. And who has hired you to kill me? Russia? China? Nobody. Then... <coughs> why is it that you seek to take my life? Because you're nothing but a murdering son of a bitch. <coughs> Nonsense. You're planning to use Nikolai to set off a war in Russia, aren't you? To protect Japan. From the West, yes, that's correct. What do you mean? Unless someone in Asia stands up to them. <coughs> the Western powers will take over here. China, Korea, and Japan all will fall. But I will not allow my beloved homeland to suffer such an ignoble destiny. That's a load of bull! Why do you have to stir up a war in Russia to do that? China capitulated, gave in to the West 100 years ago. Among all the nations of Asia, only Japan has been able to take a stand against them. But in order to successfully continue resisting, we must become bigger and stronger. We must plant the seeds of future power now on the Asian continent. And when the moment finally arrives for us to hurry, to the aid of the beleaguered Russia, it will be Japan that will become the supreme ruler of all of Eurasia. So, that's why you've done all this? Correct. Is that why you used Kato to kidnap Nikolai? It was always my firm intention to have him become the ruler of the new Russia. <laughs> That's insane! If you do that, it's gonna set off a whole new war! All wars end eventually. Suffering is merely temporary. What about all the people that will die? An unfortunate necessity. Bastard! You can kill me, but my plan will not end. Someone will take my place. Hmm. Ah, no, stay in there, Kosuke. Uh. Kosuke, get away from here. Out of the way! Kosuke! Ah! Please. My grandson is innocent. Don't kill him! Don't kill him. I'm begging you. Please. Please. Don't you dare beg for his life! What about the people you sent to kill in your name? What about the children whose lives have been snuffed out by your soldiers? How many parents have begged just like you for their children's lives? They cried and begged and pleaded for their lives. And they were killed anyway. They tried to protect their homes, and they were killed anyway! Ah! <laughs> How many people will you sacrifice for your stupid, petty ambitions? <laughs> Protecting them from the West, huh? <laughs> well, protect this! Doing it for your country, huh? Well, here's what I think of that! I say you did it for yourself! Stupid, arrogant idiot! You should rot in hell! 
Rot in hell! Rot in hell! Finish the job, man. Take him out. Kid too. He'll come back for revenge. Where's Yuri? Huh? Well... He's still pretty down, huh? Well... I'll see what I can do to help. Um, Roger? Karen? The leader of the Inugami clan was looking for you. For me, you sure? Yes. She's at the Fountain of Sukune. Mm. Uh... <clears throat> yeah. You couldn't kill him, huh? No. Even though you wanted to, right? Yeah. Hurts, doesn't it? Yeah. Good. That's how it's supposed to feel. Hmm? He's lost it all. His iron soldiers, his mad scientist, Kato, Nikolai, everything. All he's got to look forward to is a short, sad life. But it's more than enough time to think over all the crimes he's committed. The thing is, even he was just doing what he thought was right. He was fighting for his country, his grandson. But what have I been fighting for? When that kid was staring at me like that, I realized I had no idea. You're fighting for Alice, are you not? I think that you are. Huh? For the world she loved so much? The future? And also you? Her dreams were very important to you. So, I think that maybe you fight to try to help her dreams come true. Am I wrong? Alice. Come on. You've got to buck up. This isn't like you. No matter how much you want to, you know you can't change the past. I know that. But I can't stop. It's difficult to live a life without having any regrets. <laughs> Yeah, I've been alive for 700 years, and I've spent most of that time regretting. <laughs> That's right, laugh. Laugh and just go on. That's the best thing to do. Then, you can look back at even the saddest things and smile. Yuri? Yeah? I'm going to bring Alice back to you. What? The emigre magic that Kato used on Olka. Many famous wizards have tried and failed. Even I have felt its dark call. However, I've always resisted its temptation. But... 
What is Kato planning? We simply have to find out what his intentions are. Like he said, the secret is in the book. You're going to bring the dead back to life? The two of us will. If one of us goes crazy and turns into a monster, then the other one will be forced to kill him and stop the magic. How about it? Okay. I want to do it. Good. Then let's hurry up and take off for Europe. Now I've got to prepare the tools I need in order to perform the ritual. This is a bad plan. You want to see me? So, how is he doing? He's still pretty depressed. I'm sure he will be fine soon. Oh. Yes. He is so much like my brother, inside and out. Is... is he really? You care for him, don't you? Um. Yes, I like him a lot. I thought so. Uh, a woman like me. Do you think he could ever love me? Love you? I... I mean, you'd know as his aunt. Oh, come now. Don't be silly. Of course he could love you. <laughs> Thank you so much. You're welcome. But what is it exactly that's worrying you? What is it, my dear? Nothing. It's just... Yes? I know that he doesn't feel the same way. Are you sure? He's still in love with Alice. Alice? His lover. She died protecting him. Oh. But I love him too, more than anything. I don't think he knows how I feel. But you do plan to fight for him. Don't you? Yes. That boy was born under a strange star. His whole life, he's been fighting with his destiny. His destiny? Yes. No matter what he does, he cannot escape. You too, Karen. You were born with a heavy destiny as well. Me too? Yes. I called you to this place because I wish to give you this. It's a photo of him from just before he went overseas. I thought that you might like to see what he looked like as a child. Okay. Not weird at all. Also, did you guys notice that uh, Roger Bacon has two separate models? One for, you know, I guess like, uh, well, we'll say one for beauty shots or up close, and the other one for, you know, uh, not so much detail. I thought that was uh, extremely interesting. Okay, I'm just gonna use the tent because last time I didn't use a tent. I got bodied for it
Did I mark that cutscene? I think I did. I think I did. It was pretty long, so I'll, I'll find it again. Alright, anything, anything. Nothing. It's a very important picture, keep that in mind. It's not important. There's nothing important about that picture. Just like there's nothing important about Karen and why she's been on this journey with us this entire time. Nothing important at all. Okay, so I think I've decided that Lucia is not going to make the cut here. So with that in mind, I need to remove certain breasts from her. Let's see, Evil Ray and Evil Born. Let's see, we need to get rid of this one. Alright, so you have Art Cure, you have Cure, you have Resurrection. So what would benefit you on a turn where we need to know exactly what we want to do? Oh, I didn't realize that it says down here, uh, right here, equip to Anastasia. That's nice. Give you Arc Barrier. You still have six available. I don't know if I want to give you Cure Plus. Alright, so you have Arc Shield. You know, an Arc Surge would be pretty nice. This mana cost still keeps going up. Oh, you can't equip anymore. So I would have to get rid of something, so we'd probably get rid of Surge. I don't use that very often. I don't want to do Cure Plus or Cure All. Cure Plus. Okay, then I want to mess around with Solomon's Key. Let's see, I think we have 10, and I think we need more than 10. Oh, this one's a new one. I haven't seen that one before. Still missing some there, missing some there, missing some there. Did get a new one here. Uh, appears as a small donkey. He accounts the souls of heretics. He has similar powers to Murmur, near whom he lives. one we still have nine we have four okay yeah this one uh this one is new archangel that rules all death and rebirth next to his castle lies the wilderness of war and the eternal boneyard There's only a boneyard right there, so we're putting you there. 
I guess I technically didn't see what Astaroth gives. Holy Resist. Increase one's allies. Light class special attack defense. Light class special effect. Circular large. That doesn't really seem all that worth it. Not at all. He's here to look after Yuri. <laughs> <laughs> uh, he said we needed to go to Europe. There we go. Is that the Queen's Garden? Uh, it's 4.30 right now. I think this is a good time to call it quits. Uh, someday this game will end. I I don't know when it's going to end. We've we've reached the all right. It's the end of the game like three times now with um, with that one guy. Uh, I forget his name. Rasputin. Then we went to uh, Nikolai and um, and um, Astaroth, and that wasn't it. And then we went to Astaroth again, and that wasn't it. And then we went to the leader of Japan, basically, and that wasn't it. And it seems like now we're going after Kato. So, yeah. Not extras, you're at the midpoint? 36 hours midpoint? That's a little suspicious to me, but. Who knows? I I honestly have no idea what they they're planning to do because a lot of this story has been uh, very piecemeal and not uh, very well linked together in, in a lot of respects. It just feels like we complete something and it's just like, oh, go over there. There's there's something waiting for you over there. And so we just kind of go over there and and we, we start some other random thing. It, it doesn't feel like we're trying to save the world in this game. <laughs> I don't know what we're doing. But anyways, uh, thanks for watching. Appreciate it. I'll be back uh, tomorrow on a day that is not Taco Tuesday uh, for some um, more Shadow Hearts Covenant. So thanks for watching. Appreciate it. See you tomorrow at 7 a.m. Pacific. Peace.